You're watching The Ugly Inside. Subscribe below. Ugly Inside TV outside St. Mary's, Southampton 1, Happowell 1, Dan, Jordan. Who or what to blame is to, uh, for tonight's performance? Claude Peel. Claude Peel for me. Um, it's going to be controversial, people are not going to like it, but for me, I don't like the way we're playing football. It's not just tonight, it's consistently. I think people uh, had their uh, eyes blinded by the Everton result, which was a, a first, uh, first minute goal, which we defended well, to be honest. But then apart from that, it's been the same story. 1-0, 0-0, bad results like this. We should be easily beating this team. We should be. Uh, it's just shocking. shocking. I mean, let's be fair, Happowell have been tough to break down in Europa League, but look, we, we didn't match what our expectations were, what we needed to do. A minimum was a nil-nil, and I didn't think at any point we were looking like we were, we were going to go ahead. Uh, the trouble is, you set out for a game like this uh, to draw nil-nil, you're not going to do it. It all cracks me up. So if we'd have played like we played in the last 10 minutes for the whole game, we'd probably battle them 4-0. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? We, we, we're setting up for a nil-nil, and it's, it's, it's just pure. We're so defensive. Why? We've got up through the divisions, up to where we are, by playing attacking football every week. No matter what the team is, Man United, Arsenal, Chelsea, Liverpool, we always attack them, and we always get decent results. And then we're coming, coming against, against an Israeli team and trying to get a nil-nil out of it. I just don't understand it, and I don't agree with it. And for me, pure out. Oh, controversial. Nathan Redman for me. Oh, every single ball, every single time he tried to cross that ball in, it always hit the first defender. I completely agree with you, yeah. Nathan, uh, Nathan had a very shocking game today. Um, probably his worst in the same shot, I'd say. Everything he did, cutting in, losing the ball, every, uh, every cross he had, skied into Rose Ed. Just, he's had a few shocking games recently, I think this is his worst. Dan, what's got to change on Sunday against Middlesbrough? To be honest, mate, you know, it's, 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 it's hard to think about that now after that. But, I mean, for me, I mean, Puel's got to go. I mean, he's using Redmond. All right, Redmond, he's an half-decent winger that can cut in and, and bend the ball in the net now and again. And we saw him and try and say he's a new Thierry Henry. I mean, playing him up front. I mean, for me, I mean, Puel's got to go. We've got to overhaul this team. We should have got someone like Pellegrini when we could have, right, and playing attacking, attacking football like we've played all the way through the leagues. And now he's turning around saying, oh, well, you know, Redmond, he, he could be the new Henri. No, mate, not for me, not for me. You know, there's nothing we can do against Middles. Like, oh, if we change against Middles, like, we're out of the Europa League. Mm. We, we worked hard to get in there, yeah. you know, and we're out of it. You know, and it doesn't matter about Middlesbrough on Sunday. I would rather play the weakened team against Middlesbrough, you know, and batter these lot. But no, you know, you know, again, the Premier League commands everything. You know, it's, 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 not, it's not on, to be honest, mate. I'm not happy about it. Cheers, fellas.